Hi, as you can see, I am back in my house, back in the home office after five months of living in a hotel. It's, it's amazing and I'm so happy to, to have some space back again. Uh, but that's not why I brought here to you. That's not why I brought you here today. What I wanted to tell you about is some of the changes that I'm seeing in the Austin real estate market right now. Now, we know what happened last year um, around November, December, right about this time in the year, it really started picking up and, and we started getting a lot of multiple offers and, and of course prices went up a, a good amount last year. Now, like I've been telling you, the last five or six months have, have stabilized. Um, the, the price has flattened out a little bit, you know, maybe even like pulled back by a hair. Uh, but, but overall, it was, it was somewhat stable, somewhat calm, and very much like the normal market that we have here in, in Austin. Uh, but, but about a month ago, I'd say, you know, when we, when we had buyer clients or when we had listings, we could just feel that, you know, maybe we're getting a little more offers than normal. Uh, things are moving a little bit quicker. And, and definitely over this last week or two, I've really noticed, um, you know, we, we were, we're starting to see some homes with, with just more, more and more offers than they were having before. And, and really wanted to take a look and see why. And, and, and I think this is gonna be one of, the, one of the big reasons that you should take a look at. Uh, I, I don't know any better way to do this, so, so I'm just gonna show you the, the screen. But, so if you look here, this is a chart of how many active listings there are in the Austin market. Uh, so, so over here, this is the summer of 2020, and you can see when it got just super low around last winter. This is this is December here to about March, and and over here it's about 350 homes each month that are available in Austin. And this is also when buyer demand, frankly, like went up a little bit. So as the buyer demand went up and there weren't that many houses, it, it really pushed, uh, you know, really start pushing the, the price up. And, and you can see how it is around here when I said the, the market stabilized, a lot more homes are coming onto the market, which is, which is normal. You know, spring and summer is usually when a lot more people sell their homes. And, and also last year, more people started selling their homes because the prices had gone up a lot and they thought, hey, this is, you know, what, why not? This is a good time to, to do that. Uh, but what we're seeing now is, is right here. It, it's starting to come back down. This bar here, this is November this year. And if you look at this, versus November of last year, which is this bar here, we're just a little bit lower. So last November we had about, we had 643 active listings on the market. This November, it was down to 486. And when I look at the market this morning, there's only actually 416 homes on the market, which would put it right about here. So we're getting pretty close to these low levels. Um, so I'm not saying that that we'll have a, does this work? There we go. I'm not saying that we're gonna have a repeat of last year. That, that would be something that's very hard to duplicate. Uh, however, uh, I could see that, that there's a supply crunch again. You know, there's just not enough homes out there for the amount of people that are moving to Austin that wanna buy in Austin. And, and it is going very likely it will push prices up in this next year. And that's really just the thing I wanted to point out to you. It's just, just a feeling, it's just starting. I can't predict the future, but right now it's starting to look at least like a little bit of a, a little bit of a replay of what we saw last year. Uh, but we're gonna continue monitoring, we will continue monitoring this. And of course, let you know when we see anything new. As always, just, just reach out if you want to chat or, or talk about, uh, you know, if you have any interest in, in buying or selling a home here in Austin. Hope you guys have a fantastic holiday. Uh, take some time off, be with the families, and see you next year.